Greetings, it's me, that ghost, and today I'm going to play a game where I draw popular cartoon characters with my eyes closed and see if my friends can guess who I drew. In order for you guys at home to be able to participate, I'm not going to say who I am drawing until after I've drawn them, so while I'm drawing with my eyes closed, you can wonder what on earth I'm drawing. So I'm going to start off with the first one now. I'm closing my eyes, and here we go. Okay, I honestly don't know how many more details I'd be comfortable adding without opening my eyes, so I'm going to open them now. And I'm surprised at how decent that turned out. <laughs> it actually kind of looks like what I was imagining. So, I was trying to draw Megamind, and you can see here his, his head and his eyes, and there's his big collar, and there's his limbs, and the little exclamation mark shirt. Um... I think this is a fairly good Megamind drawing, so I'm really hoping my friends will recognize this one. I'm going to add another layer and make a new drawing. Okay, so I'm going to close my eyes and hope for the best. Oh, it looks like I accidentally went into a new tab with my eyes closed. Let me see what I drew. I did not draw anything. Okay, so I'm just going to ignore that and close my eyes again and try my best to resume the drawing. Okay, I'm going to open my eyes. And that looks absolutely terrible. So, uh... This was supposed to be a drawing of Aang from Avatar The Last Airbender. There's this little forehead thing. Uh, there's this little wind glider. I think I tried to draw Momo when I accidentally hopped over into a new tab. So I don't think my friends will be able to guess this. If someone guesses it from the arrow or maybe from the shape over here, I will be really surprised and a little bit happy but also a little bit disappointed they actually figured it out so i'm gonna pop into a new layer okay this one i think i'll probably be able to draw with my eyes closed and i'll probably be recognizable but who knows okay i'm gonna open my eyes and uh interesting so uh this was Supposed to be Homer Simpson. You see, I, I gave him a face. I gave him a pink sprinkled donut. I tried to give him a shirt collar and a mouth and stubble and an eye and hair. Uh, I have a feeling people will be able to recognize him in my friend group because he has the distinctive M hair. But besides that, I don't know if he'll be recognizable. So I'm going to pop into another layer. Okay, this next one, I have a feeling with my eyes open, I could draw something that 100% of people will recognize with my eyes closed. I'm not fully sure. In order to help my friends and give them an advantage, I'm going to draw his most recognizable features first. So hopefully they'll be placed in a way that with all the other features, people will figure it out. So I'm going to close my eyes now. I'm going to open my eyes. It looks like with my eyes closed, I accidentally activated the mirror tool, but I'm not going to let my friends know that. So when they see this, I want them to think this is just like part of the drawing. Um, this looks a lot worse than how I saw it in my head. I don't even know from this drawing I'd be able to know what it was. It kind of looks like a platypus, but <laughs> uh, it's supposed to be Harry Potter. We got his scar. We got his glasses. You probably figured that out while watching, so it's the first things I drew. But as the drawing progressed, I think I, I kind of ruined it. But again, we'll see. So I'm going to hide that, make a new layer. All right, I'm going to close my eyes. This one, I think, is the most likely it's going to fail. I don't know what else I should add, so I'm going to open my eyes. 
Honestly, this isn't that bad. Um, I don't know if my friends will recognize it, but it's supposed to be Shrek. Uh, you know, here's his face and his ears. That's supposed to be his head. And this is his body, little belt, his legs. So, you know, maybe someone will see this and think Shrek because of the ears. I'm not fully sure. We're going to find out. Okay, next layer. Here we go. So, this one, I think 100% is going to fail. <laughs> but we'll see. Okay, I'm going to open my eyes. It looks a lot better than I thought. Which, you know, looking at this, you'd think like, how does it look better than you thought this looks terrible? I thought because I planned to draw the entire body for this one, it wouldn't it wouldn't turn out. But I think there's enough key details for someone to know who this is. So I wanted to draw Rainbow Dash. And you can see it's a Pegasus. And you can see her little cutie mark. And you can see she has spiky hair. So I'm hoping someone watching this would... Not watch. I hope, I'm hoping when I send this to my friends, they'll recognize who it is. I think all my friends know about My Little Pony. I'm not fully sure. I I didn't... I should have Googled, like, most popular cartoon characters. But instead, I just wrote down the first cartoon characters that popped into my head. And decided to do this. Okay, so I'm gonna hide this and make another layer. Okay, I'm gonna close my eyes and here we go. Okay, I'm gonna open my eyes. And this one turned out terrible. <laughs> um, this one, I was trying to draw a Shadow the Hedgehog and I, I think maybe based on the mouth shape right here, a friend might guess that it's a hedgehog, but I don't know if they'll know it's Shadow. I, I tried to give him edgy hair. I don't think it turned out. But, um... <laughs> for some reason, this one really cracks me up. I don't know why, because I'd say it's equally bad as all the other ones. But this one just makes me feel like laughing for some reason. So now, we're on to our last one. I think I'm just going to draw uh, his head, but I'm going to close my eyes and we'll see how this goes. Um, now my head I'm trying to remember. I think that's about all the details. Everyone that shows a really simple face. I'm gonna open my eyes. Oh no. Well, one, I, sh I should have given him his nose. I forgot all about his nose until I opened my eyes and realized that without his nose, he looked like evil Phineas. Um, but this is Dr. Doofenshmirtz. <laughs> um, so, I'm gonna... I'm going to send these off to my friends now. Okay, so now I'm going to go back through the responses I got for each of the photos. I didn't record it live because there was no way to control when my friends would or wouldn't be online, and even though I got instant responses for some, other times I had to wait many minutes for a response, and I don't know if I'd be able to make actually interesting content over slightly over half an hour of one friend guessing what's in these photos. So to start, he guessed the first one correctly as Homer, and he joked the author of the Odyssey. He did not get Aang. I don't know who the cheat is. I'm assuming it's like a cheetah thing. I don't know. We got Phenomenal from Phenomenal Y Fern. Where no, it's it's Doctor Dink from Phenomenal Y Fern. <laughs> um, he guessed Santa for Shadow, and now that he's said it. I cannot unsee it. This is 100% Santa Claus. He got Rainbow Dash correct. Uh, he did not get Harry Potter correct, and I do not blame him at all. He guessed Invader Zim for Megamind. <laughs> and he guessed Manjin Boo for Shrek. He commented, I would not draw as well if I was blind. So, uh, yeah. That's why I draw with my eyes open. Right now I'm still getting used to drawing with the actual drawing pad with my computer. But once I get used to that, I'm going to try to upload speed paints fairly recently. Earlier today I was making a drawing with it and I was not a big fan. So I'm going to keep practicing. Right now I'm the most comfortable using my phone. But uh, thank you for watching. Have a great day. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.